Hi folks, we've been busy researching microphones for podcasting to help you figure out what you need to make your best audio and video content and stay on budget. Links to all the products in the review are in the description box below, where you'll find current pricing for your region wherever possible. The video has timestamps, so that you can jump straight to the microphone that interests you the most. Now before I move on, we'd love to hear what microphone you're using right now and what you think of it. Let us know in the comments. Okay, let's get into it. Here are the top 5 best microphones for podcasting. The fifth product on our list is the Rode PodMic. The Rode PodMic is a cardioid dynamic microphone that's ideal for podcasting. It features a dual mesh and internal pop filter, which minimises plosive sounds when you're recording your voice. We all love a durable build and that's precisely what this mic offers. The pod mic boasts an all metal body with a sleek looking ceramic finish. It also boasts an internal shock mount to ensure that the mic doesn't catch any bumps on the mount or table. There's a bonus for people who own the Rodecaster Pro as pairing it with the pod mic automatically enhances the depth and presence of your voice. The sound you get with this Rode microphone is terrific. It gives you a warm, crisp and rich sound that brings out the quality of your voice. This makes it well suited for podcasting as well as vocal recordings. Its affordable price and ease of use make it ideal for beginners. Even if you don't have a studio setup and are recording in your living room or office space, the pod mic's directional pickup pattern rejects off-axis noise to give you professional quality audio. It's hard to find a microphone that can compete with this Rode product at the same price range. Here's something you should know before buying the Rode pod mic. Some streamers will find that the directional pickup of the Rode pod mic makes it challenging to move around while still capturing the entire quality of your voice. If you're looking for an excellent microphone for podcasting, you'll love the Rode pod mic. The fourth product on our list is the Audio-Technica AT2035PK. Audio-Technica's AT2035 is a versatile podcasting microphone, perfect for recording podcasts and vocals. Amazon offers a great bundle for beginners that pairs the microphone with the ATH M20X headphones for a fantastic studio setup. The AT2035 is a large diaphragm condenser mic, which gives you a smooth and natural sound with low noise. It also has a high sound pressure level rating, giving the mic a wide dynamic range to pick up quiet voice or low SPL to loud voice or high SPL without distorting. If you're worried about a sound coming from your desk, then say no more. The Audio-Technica microphone comes with a custom shock mount that will give you excellent sound isolation. It also has an adjustable boom arm that can rotate the full 360 degrees, so you can move around if you're doing a live stream or hosting a podcast. Recording vocals is a breeze with this mic. Its cardioid pickup does a great job at rejecting ambient noise while still keeping that rich and detailed quality of your voice. It also boasts a switchable high-pass filter and a 10 decibel pad to help reduce unwanted rumbling or noise. Here's something you should know before buying the Audio-Technica AT2035. It's not for people who want a can-do-everything microphone. The AT2035 excels at home and project applications. The Audio-Technica AT2035 is a solid choice for beginners who want an excellent mic without breaking the bank. It works well in small studios or home streaming setups. The third product on our list is the Elgato Wave 3. The Elgato Wave 3 is a sensitive condenser microphone that will take your vocal recordings to the next level. It features a cardioid polar pattern which means it picks up sound from the front and rejects sound from behind, so you'll get less unwanted ambient noise. The Wave 3 offers high quality 24-bit recording, giving you plenty of wiggle room in post-production. The build quality is excellent with this Elgato microphone. It comes with a dedicated stand and has a metal and hard plastic combination of materials. It also has a matte texture which looks great in any setup. The microphone is compact and feels sturdy. The controls are also fantastic. The user-friendly controls consist of a knob and a touch-sensitive sensor. The knob has an LED ring that turns red when you mute the mic using the sensor, so you won't have to fumble around in the dark. The controls are intuitive, so you'll be used to them in no time. Another fun feature of the Elgato Wave 3 is the accompanying software app, Wavelink. A virtual audio mixer takes all of your programs and Windows-generating sound and organises them into one neat package. 
This Elgato mic sound profile is made for podcasters. It records spoken word content with rich detail and accurate mid and high frequencies. The clip guard feature also helps you avoid clipping your audio by applying compression automatically. Here's something you should know before buying the Elgato Wave 3. It has a de-emphasized bass, which can be an issue if you plan to record instruments aside from vocals. If you're in the market for a reliable microphone for podcasting in a home studio, you'll love the Elgato Wave 3. Once you dial in your desired settings, you can keep recording without a worry in sight. The second product on our list is the Rode NT-USB. The Rode NT-USB is a versatile studio quality microphone that gives you fantastic recordings at an affordable sub-$200 price. It's a high quality mic with convenient USB connectivity for podcasters who are working on a computer or laptop. It is also compatible with cameras, tablets, headphones and even iPads. The sound delivered by the NT-USB is superb. It does this with its cardioid capsule set in standard studio fashion. Voice recordings sound clear and natural with this Rode microphone as it keeps all the detail of your voice without adding ambient noise. You don't have to worry about setting the mic at a comfortable height as it works from several angles, perfect for when you're recording with a guest. The Rode NT-USB rejects low rumble from vibrations, so it's ideal if you don't have a shock mount yet. Rode has thought out the design of this microphone. It comes with an onboard pop shield to reduce plosive sounds. It also has a headphone port that you can use and a nice set of controls coming as two sturdy knobs. The build is solid and durable while still maintaining a compact body. Here's what you should know before buying the Rode NT-USB. The boom bracket is made of plastic material which might break under heavy use. If you're looking for a well-equipped microphone for all your home podcasting needs, the Rode NT-USB is an excellent choice. The first product on our list is the Blue Bluebird SL. The Bluebird SL from Blue is an eye-catching XLR condenser microphone that looks and sounds terrific. The Bluebird SL is great at capturing natural and crystal clear vocals. It uses an extended high-end frequency, sophisticated mids and detailed rich lows. This helps you deliver Blue's legendary broadcast quality sound. A great feature of the Bluebird SL is its Class A circuitry and a transformerless design. This eliminates an additional circuit path that could colour your sound. There are also selectable features such as a minus 20 decibel pad and a 100 Hz high pass filter. The 20 decibel pad keeps your sound distortion free while the high pass filter reduces vibration pickup from your desk. You'll find Blue's custom gold sputtered diaphragm at the head of the mic. It doesn't just look amazing, it also helps deliver superior resonance when you're recording higher frequencies to allow the vocals to shine through. The Bluebird SL is a fantastic buy as an all-rounder microphone. Although the microphone's main strength is in voice, it sounds excellent with acoustic guitar and other acoustic instruments, so podcasters who dabble with music will love it. Here's something you should know before buying the Blue Bluebird SL. It doesn't record lower frequencies well, so it might not be the best choice if you want to do ASMR. If you're looking for a nicely priced microphone for your podcasting needs, you'll love the quality that Blue delivers with the Bluebird SL. And there you have it folks, the five microphones for podcasting that got us excited this year. If this video helped you in any way, let us know by giving it a like, and if you're new here, hitting the subscribe button. If you would like to see some more reviews from our team here at Gear Music Tech, check out this one on smartphone mics on the left, or this one on on-camera mics on the right. We look forward to seeing you back here on Gear Music Tech soon. Bye for now.